What's going on, guys? Um, UFC Fight Night just watched it. The main event it was uh, Islam Makhachev versus Bobby Green. Um, I think you know the story. Bobby Green agrees to fight uh, Islam Makhachev on short notice. I think uh, Bobby Green fought last week. If I'm not mistaken, that the last weekend or two weeks weekends ago, and. Um, yeah, man, he steps up and uh, saves the car, saves the main event. Um, you know, uh, Islam Akashev gets to fight, have a payday, and uh, he moves on. Uh, Makashev was scheduled to fight Benil uh, Dariush, which was a fight where I was looking forward to. It was um, it had me intrigued because Dariush is a pretty accomplished fighter. He has good stand-up, good uh, grappling skills, and... Uh, I thought he would uh, have given uh, Islam Makhachev a run for his money, but uh, Benil got uh, got injured, so um, Bobby Green stepped in. Bobby Green, um, I'll be honest, man, I didn't see him winning this fight. It was a very predictable fight. Bobby Green is not known for having this great takedown defense. He loves to stand up. He loves to strike... Uh, and have stand-up fights and uh you know just uh return fire boxing and uh, that's his style that is his style he's not known for the grappling he's not known for a lot of wrestling and um islam makashev is islam makashev is verse uh um basically he's uh he's uh you know another uh Khabib Numargomedo, the way he style, he is he has always trained for years with with uh with uh Khabib and uh, Khabib is, is his coach and and uh, Javier Mendez the the the, the stand up coach also and uh, same camp uh, so you know um he's been winning he's been winning for a long time now, Makashev has and he um. He's young. He's uh, you know, he's 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 just very accomplished, very focused, very strong guy, and uh, he's just bound to to uh, for a title, a title fight, a title shot. I'm hoping he fights Oliveira. Uh, Oliveira, I think, is a good match. Oliveira, his stand up has uh, has come such a long way, man. He's he's so good with the stand up now, and he's a big big threat on the ground so Islam Makashev has his work cut out for him if he ever faces Oliveira. That said with this win I mean Makashev made it look easy it didn't last long it just one round uh, Islam Makashev very predictable um, he took uh, Bobby Green down Bobby Green didn't have much of a takedown defense he, he went down uh, he fought. He, you know, he he uh, he threw some elbows. He was throwing some shots. He was he was touching him, but uh, once Makashev is on top of you, like like uh, Bispin said, you know, it was just a terrible position to be in to have Makashev on top of you that way. And Makashev, uh, surprisingly, uh, he didn't end it with a rear naked choke or a guillotine. He could have chosen to do something like that. He didn't. He ended up. Uh, he ended the fight with ground and pound. Uh, basically, convinced the the referee to step in because he was just gonna keep going, uh, grounding and pounding on Bobby Green. And you know uh, the ref looks out for the safety of that fighter, and uh, he was not gonna stand there and just let Bobby Green take shots. Bobby Green was taking shots, so the fight had to be stopped. It was a very impressive win. Uh, I see a lot of comments on in YouTube that um you know that he has a boring that Makashev has a boring is a boring fighter. I don't know how anybody can say that because if you watch MMA, if you're used to watching MMA, if you know the sport, MMA makes martial arts, man. You know that you either watch somebody that's very good with the stand up or somebody that's very good with the ground game and there's going to be mix up. That's what that's where the mix part of the of the sport comes in where you see fighters that uh they mix it up well makashev is one of those but uh he's he's the, the he's very dominant 
with his ground game, with his wrestling, with his grappling. That is his specialty. That's that's his bread and butter. And uh, the way he does it, the technique he uses, um, that's, you know, that's not boring to watch. Uh, so I don't understand when people say those kinds of things. That takes skills, that takes cardio, that takes uh, strength, that takes uh, patience and, 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 you know, thinking in there um, of what you're going to do how you react to that fighter when that when Bobby Green reacts to whatever um, move uh, Makachev makes, it's Makachev that makes sure he is always in the dominant position. That's not boring. That's 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 a technique, man. That that takes skills and it's awesome to watch. And you know, I come from from um, from being a huge fan of of uh jiu jitsu you know so it, it's always awesome to watch so i just don't don't understand those claims of of uh Makashev being boring uh i just don't see it i mean boring this fighter Makashev, um in the 155 division from what i see from far you know um fighters don't want to don't don't want to fight this guy they don't want to fight him they especially in short notice they're not gonna do that and uh, a lot of people are trying to to avoid him you know so it's just one of those things man that uh he, he's a scary fighter scary fighter because he has skills and a style that a lot of other fighters just don't wanna don't wanna deal with they don't wanna deal with it and uh so here we are again you know islam akashev uh, another win under the column, I think he's 22-1 now. And uh, from what he said in, in his post-fight interview, he's going to wait for a title shot. And I don't blame him. I think he should. At this point, he's done everything he's being asked to do. And the guy just, um, he should wait for his title shot. I don't I don't blame him. I think he that's the smart thing to do at this point. They asked him about Benil. And he, I think, I believe he said that he'll face Benil when, when he has the title on hand and and uh yeah i agree with that i mean he agreed to fight benil he was there benil wasn't um i understand benil got injured but that's how it is man that's how this game is played and and uh is that the guy that's there is the guy that uh reaps the 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 benefits you know um of, of victory of showing up and uh of and he gets to move on he gets to move on Anyways, guys, thank you for uh, listening to me and uh, give me likes, dislikes, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for listening and please keep watching. Peace.